Hey guys, so, um, just got done watching episode 2 of the Flash TV series, and I gotta say, um, Arrow definitely has some competition for the best superhero show, as does Gotham. Um, second episode was way better than the first, and I liked the first a lot, but this one was really good too. We have this guy, that, the main villain in this, the whole thing about it is, um... This guy can, my hair looks crazy, this guy can basically like clone himself and like make multiple versions of himself and faces off against him. It's kind of like a Hydra thing where you cut off one head, a bunch of more just appear. It's cool. Um, the effects were really good, the action was really good in this. Um, we figure out more of the detective's relationship with uh, Barry and that he's sort of a father figure while his real father was in prison. And, um, the whole thing is, like, family, the feeling of, like, working as a team. And it works really well with the past stuff and sort of rejecting him. And then the future stuff where, here's crazy, where he learns to accept him. So that was really cool. Um, great effects in this one. One of the, one of my favorite scenes, personally, was where Iris is asking him, like, so what's up? And then he tells her, like, he's runs at super speed and tells her everything that's on his mind. He's like, well, I like you. And then, um, and I want to tell you this and I want to tell you that. But then as soon as he stops, like, he's just like, um, I don't know. Like, that's, that was really cool. Really, really creative and imaginative. Um, we get more with the guy in the wheelchair who I think is going to be Professor Zoom. Um, get more of the Barry stuff with Iris. Um, kind of really reminds me of Smallville a little bit, except for the fact that the detective's in on his secret, and, like, gives him crap about, like, yeah, I come up with better excuses than that, so I kind of like that, um, very traditional superhero stuff in this one, so, eventually he beats the villain, um, we, we are introduced to Stag in this one, who, um, for comic book fans, is uh, the guy who inadvertently creates metamorpho. The guy that can like change to different shapes and do a bunch of different superpowers in the comics. Um, so that was interesting. He kind of gets killed off in the end. I thought that was weird. Him and the guy in the wheelchair aren't really friends and stabs him at the end. So there's that. I'm interested to see where um, that goes. They, they tease Stag and um one of the seasons of air with like metamorpho and all that stuff so I wonder if they're ever going to do anything with it or it's just going to be like an easter egg um I really like him like one line he says like we all got struck by that lightning that day like they're really like forming a team with team flash and everything I think that's really cool um and yeah this is just like a great show they're moving really fast no, no pun intended like um Arrow did at the beginning, and I can't wait to see what they do next. Um, speaking of which, we have a new Arrow review up tomorrow. If I'm going to rate this right now, um, out of five stars, probably get a four out of five. Just really great, really great effects. I like the theme of family and teamwork. Um, really well put together, not a lot of flaws in it, and very creative and imaginative. Um, I highly recommend this episode. So what did you guys think? Comment below, let me know, and uh, look forward to Arrow reviews tomorrow.